Hey guys, how's it going? So the door just went and this just came through my doors. Right, let's get this bad boy open, shall we? So, it's a, it's a Telecaster apparently, or a Telecaster style. Guitar. Right. So this is his old demo guitar from about four years ago. Right. You guys get the first look, just the same with me. Oh, it's like past the parcel. Oh, nice. Look at this. There she be. Get on me old booties. How's it going guys? Hope you're well. So, as you can tell from the previous video, I've been sent this rather lovely Telecaster T-style guitar to try out by Richard at Bebbington Guitars. It's a friend of mine, or a friend of mine's dad, basically. So, this rather lovely thing is a Swamp Ash Telecaster, or T-style. It's actually slightly smaller of a, the bottom cutaway is actually slightly less pronounced and um, it's made out of swamp ash it's got a contoured heel and tummy cut there so very ergonomic on the back some Seymour Duncan pickups it's got stainless steel frets soft V carve neck carve is super nice and some shallow lock and tuning pegs three aside headstock super nice guitar really really lovely to play um, I'll show you the cutaway compared to a normal Telecaster which I've got here, my parts caster and you can see it's actually the lower body horn is slightly small, um, slightly less protruding and the body is actually a bit smaller by the looks of it. He actually spoke to me before Christmas about this um, but I didn't want to say anything about it just in case um, it all fell through so I actually got the guitar well just a couple of days ago and I've been giving it a a good pasting as he asked me to uh, put it put it through its paces and I'm pleased to say it's as lovely as I thought it would be from Richard's high standards plays really nice reminds me of a friend's um, got a friend who used to have or he still does have a 90s or 80s custom shop Schecter from way back in the day and it really reminds me of that the carve of the neck just totally took me back to that guitar that I used to play like 20 years ago so this is one of his old demo guitars from about four years ago that he built and he's um, given it out to a few players to try out and you know see what they think of it and um, so he sent it to me I'm now the lucky uh, what's the word not owner the uh, lucky holder of the guitar for a little bit to try out make some videos so you guys can see it and um, let's plug it in shall we see how it sounds so this is the clean tone on the neck pickup at the minute so got a little 59 Seymour Duncan in the bridge not sure the neck pickup is on that it's a Seymour Duncan I'll try and find out for you so that's the neck tone clean that's the middle back to the neck middle bridge Bridge, middle, and neck. That's the bridge. So I'm just going for a little cheapo Fender Mustang amp. Nothing amazing, okay? That's just straight in. No effects, dry. Let's um. Put a bit of reverb on and put my clan on to give it a bit more of a 
juice it up a little bit. Okay, so I've put the clon on and the uh, put a bit of reverb on. Just a bit of light gain, nothing crazy. Roll it back a bit. So we've got our neck, middle. So, bridge pickup sounds great. Definitely got that bite that you'd expect from a turkey. So, just turn the gain down on the clon a little bit.
So me and Richard have been chatting, and we're going to build a custom guitar together. So I'm going to pay for all the hardware and pay for all the bits, and he's going to build it completely to my specs for me, so I can get to design the body to my own shape, and then put all the hardware in myself. So I think I'm going to go with a reverse offset, so like a sort of Firebird style, but not quite so extreme. Maybe some gold foil pickups or something cool like that. So expect to see some very cool custom guitar build coming up very soon between myself and Richard at Bebbington Guitars. Don't forget to subscribe, like, smash the subscribe button or whatever all the cool kids say. Um, I think that's about it. So until next time, guys, see you later, me old booties.